guys, my name is Tiffany and welcome to my channel. So today I just wanted to do a quick Gymshark haul. Uh, technically I hauled this shirt recently. These are just cute little tank tops from, I got it at Macy's, they're just cute crop tops. And then um, I got some Converse, finally. I got a child size like four, because <laughs> they were on sale, so uh, leg day is happening, I think, maybe today. So, anyways, but we're mainly here for the Gymshark haul. Um, I got two pairs of the Flex leggings, the new ones that were just released. Took about nine, I know, like 12 days to get here, like 12. So sometimes their shipping is super fast and then sometimes it's, it's slow. But then when you get in the mail, you're like, oh my God, it's a surprise, because you forgot you ordered it. That kind of mail. So uh, I got the Flex leggings in light gray marl chalk pink. And then I got the deep teal ice blue. And I, like I said, I got them both in an extra small. I do own uh, quite a few pairs of flex leggings and I always get an extra small and I haven't had a problem with sizing. I know that a lot of people think the sizing is weird. Uh, I will say the blue ones that I'm wearing right now, I'll show you guys. So those ones, they do seem to be a little bit tighter than the pink. So I have no idea why, but uh, not to the point where they don't fit or anything or I would size up, just they feel a little bit tighter. I think gray in general, like, and no matter what you get, is generally a little bit stretchier. It could be crazy though. I don't know. Um, major difference, I would say, between these and the other one. Um, not really much, I would say though, like, these ones you'll see in the try-on, which I'll do, but they aren't as squat-proof in the gray-pink as the other ones are, but it's not like, like I'll still squat in them and I'll still feel completely comfortable, but you can see a tiny little line um, compared to what you can usually see, which is nothing. But these, even though I do prefer other leggings, it's weird, it's like other leggings I am, I'm always like more excited about, like it's when it comes to the design, like the energy seamless or something like that, but these are like my perfect leg day pants. I would say the only thing is with the waistband, they do kind of fall down and I'll show you what I'm talking about. But I don't feel comfortable wearing these with the sports bra, which is why this time I didn't get the matching sports bras. Um, because the waistband, even though you can pull them up to high waisted, once you start squatting or moving around, they'll kind of fall down. And then you're kind of left with like that muffin top, even if you don't really have a stomach, I just don't think it's flattering. It's more like take a cute picture and then put a shirt on kind of thing. So I will show you guys that in the try-on. I did want to show you size and comparisons. Uh, I got these ones quite a while ago, um, but I do actually wear these probably the most often out of all mine. Like they're perfect work pants, they're leg day pants. I don't have to think about what am I gonna do that day? Can I squat today? What pants am I wearing? So that's really nice. Um, so let's just compare. Okay, I guess the sizing is a little bit different. So. As you can see, tiny bit tighter than the old ones. Tiny, tiny bit. So nothing bad. And then lengthwise, they're actually a little bit longer. The new ones are a tiny bit longer, um, which they're all long on me and you can roll them. I don't care to roll them. Um, I just don't roll my pants. I'm just, I, yeah, I'm five foot. I'm just gonna assume that I'm short. So, you know, I don't care doesn't bother me. I did want to show you guys though, the matching sports bras look like this. Obviously the coloring is going to be the same as whatever the band coloring is. Um, but I do wear these and I think they're, they're more of like a, I just don't have a need to like buy more right now. And they're not like, they're supportive, they're great, but they're not like the cutest thing. I don't know if I love the boob contour thing, um, but yeah. They're okay. So I just didn't, I have plenty of pink bras and then I wanted to make sure I like these teal ones. I might get the matching teal bra eventually, but like I said, because I don't wear it as a matching set, I don't see the point of like, what is happening? I don't see the point of like getting it to match when like the energy seamless, I'm gonna actually wear that as a set to the gym. Whereas this, I'm gonna wear a tank top or something over it just to make myself feel more comfortable about the, I just don't wanna be readjusting my pants and be self-conscious the whole time. So. I will do the try-on portion now that I've talked. I think I covered all the points. There's no camel toe. They are squat proof. The gray, not as much. 
So if you are worried about that, just know that like you might see a tiny line, but it wasn't anything awful. It wasn't like a, someone should tell her why isn't anyone saying anything. So let's get into the try on portion and I hope you guys enjoy. All right, so like I said, I got both pairs in an extra small. Um, that just is my size for these. Usually I'm extra small on their bottoms. Um, and I got the deep teal and then the chalk pink. And these were super, uh, the gray are definitely stretchier. These are a little bit more stiff, so they fit a little bit tighter, but not to the point where I would size up at all. And here are the gray, and as you can see in a second, they are completely squat proof as well. I thought that they weren't going to be, and then I replayed the tape and found out like, yeah, I'm fine, I'm comfortable. So um, I decided to do an actual set of squats to make it more realistic for you guys. Um, and I don't feel like I see absolutely anything. So I really like both pairs. I definitely would recommend. I just kind of skipped over sports bras this time around and maybe I'll add that to a future order. But I didn't feel like I needed them. So I did quickly want to show you guys what I was talking about with the waistband. There is a lot of room obviously when they're on, but like when you squat or try to do anything, it's like it, it rolls down every time you come up. So it just starts to kind of give you that like unflattering, like they're not gonna stay in place. So I usually wear a shirt with these. I don't ever go without, like I don't do the whole bra thing unless I'm taking a picture, I put on a crop top. All right guys, that is the end of my review. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I probably should have said this in the intro, but I am completely unbiased. I'm just a customer, I paid for my stuff. Uh, and for the most part, I like it. There's always is free returns now for Gymshark if you live in the US, so that's nice. Um, you will get paid a little, like charged a little bit more than you thought with shipping, like three bucks more than what it originally was. And what else do I wanna say? They're 38 bucks. So for 38 bucks, they're not perfect, but they're still probably one of my staple pieces. I wear them probably more than any other leggings. Like they're great for just, they're just super comfortable. So um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this review and I'll see you in my next video. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.